Hello THS, my name is Caden Myers and I'm running for 9th grade class officer. How would you feel about adding student made floats to the VT game parade? Or maybe even a homecoming dance? These are just a few of the great ideas that as class officer I can help put into place. But I also want to know what your ideas are. Because it's not just about what the officers want, but what you as a student body wants. What are your ideas? What do you think will help improve school spirit? How can you help me help you? You've got a lot of great options, and you can't go wrong with whoever you decide to vote for. But I'm asking for your vote, because I know that with it, we can do great things here at THS. You see, as class officer, it's my job to create opportunities, but it's yours to take them. To quote what is possibly the most influential art piece of our time, High School Musical, we got to bop, 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 bop to the top, and wipe away our inhibitions, because we're all in this together. Thank you. Hi, I'm Gibson Bartlett. I'm running for class officer for the 2017-2018 freshman class. I would really appreciate if you voted for me. I am very excited to be at THS and for the opportunity to serve our class and community. I think I am very qualified for this position. I participate in sports and extracurricular activities, and I have lots of Viking pride. If elected, I will do my best to make this school year memorable. Thank you for considering voting for Gibson Bartlett. I'd like to begin by thanking the Tennessee High Class of 2020 for the opportunity to share with you this morning my bid for the election of the student government in this new sophomore year. I'd like to ask all of you what leadership means to you. Even if you've never thought about it, the role of a leader is one that should be met with the utmost concern and zeal, an office that should be treated with extreme caution. However you boil student government down, one should realize that without the notion of the people, it is a skeleton. In the words of Ronald Reagan, the greatest leader is not necessarily the one who does the greatest things. He's the one that gets the people to do the greatest things. I would be willing to take upon the role of being the kind of leader that motivates students to do great things through legislation. The many ideas I believe this class can fulfill through effective leadership could give way to a new era of school spirit and prosperity. Some of my ideas for the progress of our school include a period for study hall, the invention of a Viking newsletter app that notifies all students of athletic and social gatherings, and the introduction of further development for an alumni association at THS. We must be able to spearhead these operations by maintaining a collected and level-headed cabinet through the coordination of fundraising events. We should utilize such events to get students engaged in sports they wouldn't usually try, as it is beneficial to our school to include the majority of the student body in extracurricular activities. Additionally, we should increase interaction with clubs of all sorts so that students can maximize their high school experience by engaging in activities they are interested in with people who share the same interests. These initiatives to increase student productivity should be met with the highest priority. If you weren't already aware, our school is ranked 51st in the state for overall academics and athletics. If we work with steady and diligent hands, that number could rise immensely. If you would allow me, I would like to take our school to such a level of achievement. Hey guys, I'm Gracie Brooks. I'm so excited for the upcoming school year and what it has to offer. Looking back on last year, we as a class have so much to be proud of, whether it be academic or sports related. Even though last year was a pretty great year, I do recognize the need for improvement. If you elect me as class officer, I will be a powerful voice speaking for the needs and wants of the sophomore class. I will also take this opportunity as a chance for me to guide us in the direction of success. To help spread more school spirit, I plan to organize more pregame events such as having more paint wars, making sports signs, and holding tailgating events. This will make us even more pumped to cheer on our, our mighty bikes. Even though I have ideas on how to make our sophomore year special, I will recognize the ideas of the student body. This year, I want to know everyone's feedback and ideas. I will make this school year filled with opportunities to bring us together as a class because after all, we aren't low-key with the class to be. Go Vikes! 
Hello, my fellow Americans. My name is Matthew Mano, and I'm running for president in 2020. <laughs> Wait, wrong speech. Hello, fellow Vikings. I'm actually running for sophomore class officer, and I'm asking for your vote. You may not remember, but I ran for class officer last year, but sadly, I didn't win. So let's try again. I'm an experienced student council member who knows what it takes to get the job done. I may not build a wall, but I can work as hard as I can on your behalf. I promise if you vote for me, school won't get any harder. Thank you for listening, and as always, go Bearcats! I mean, Vikes! Good morning, ladies and gentlemen of the Tennessee High School Class of 2020. My name is Ryan Lilly. As you may know, last year I was a class officer. Through that experience, I now have a better understanding of what I can, can and cannot do to improve our school. I, have, I now have more realistic and more defined goals for this new school year. My first goal is to establish open communication with all who want to improve our school. I want all of you to email me with ideas that you believe can improve our school environment and our school spirit. I want your suggestions that could improve our school and I also want your complaints about what you think may be harming our school. My second goal is to organize an extra in-school spirit day to raise overall school spirit. This in-school assembly would include everyone and have some exciting uh, surprises throughout the day. Along with this we would have less elaborate spirit days that would include things such as classroom competitions, maroon and white days, and possibly costume days. Essentially, my goals are to communicate with you to improve our school environment and to instill more Viking pride in, your, in our school. Thank you for your time and go Vikings! Hi there! My name is Sarah Chen. You may remember me as the person who got first place in the talent show. And I hope everyone is enjoying my performance right now just as much. <laughs> but I am more than just a performer. I am running for class officer because I am committed to dedicating my time and greatest efforts to make sophomore year a good experience for all of us. I am involved in the student council, drama club, book club, and the mighty Viking band. In addition, I am in the Bristol Youth Leadership Program where I acquire leadership skills and love being involved in the community. Because of my many leadership roles and school involvement, you can trust me to do what is best for our class and the school as a whole. My two main ideas for this year are promoting school spirit and offering more languages at the school. One idea I have to improve school spirits is for the whole class to be involved in something fun together, such as a class tradition. For example, we could have a day for students to paint their faces maroon and white, or even adopt a school food, which has special meanings to us. In terms of languages offered at Tennessee High, my ultimate goal is to bring back Latin, I will make my effort to address this idea to the student council. Thank you for your time, and I will be honored if you choose to vote for me on August 29th. Go Vikes! Hey fellow Vikings, it's Aaliyah Burns here. Freshman year is over, and we are officially sophomores. Being your all's class president last year was such a true honor. I loved representing this class throughout the school year. If you vote for me again this year, I promise with all my heart to search for new and enjoyable ways to improve our school. I have tons of fun ideas to include and cannot wait to get this year up and running. I am here solely for you. Therefore, if you ever have a question or even have an idea about something, I encourage you to come to me at any time. You are what matters to me. And as I said last year, we are the class of 2020. It definitely does not get better than that. So we must be sure that our high school years are the best of the best. So, vote for me, Aaliyah Burns, and trust me, you will not regret it.
Hello juniors, my name is Jack Bartlett and I am running to be a part of the 2017-2018 class office. I was part of the office last year as your sophomore treasurer and I participated in decorating the main hallway for the homecoming game as well as preparing and distributing Thanksgiving food baskets. I'm part of our school swim team, TSA program, and a Wednesday night youth group that participates in various volunteer activities around the community. I hope to be re-elected because I've learned so much from being part of class office and I hope to learn even more. If re-elected, I will try my hardest to make this year one of the best our school has ever seen and one we will never forget. Thank you for your time and remember to vote Jack Bartlett. Go Vikes! Good afternoon students and faculty. For those whom I haven't met yet, my name is Casey Pace. I am a THS junior and I'm excited to run as your class officer. I look forward to speaking to each of you about your cares, concerns, and ideas about how we can improve our time here at Tennessee High School. Like you, I see things daily I would love the chance to change. I would love to be the junior's class's voice, and I would appreciate your vote. What's up, seniors? Uh, it's AJ Wilson. Uh, you might not know me because I'm not really social, but uh, I'm trying to work on this, so that's why I thought this would be a really good idea to become a class officer. Um, I have some really good ideas that can make ourselves better, make the school better. Like, who, wa who wants another club here? Like, I would love another club, personally. Uh, and I think maybe we have some other things that we could do, and we could work through it together. We can get all of these new things out there and make our senior year the best year we possibly can. Um, I'm not really big on speeches, so I'll just try to keep it short. Uh, but for AJ Wilson, and thanks, guys. Hey, Josie, are you excited for senior year? No. Like, have you achieved anything? Yeah, actually, I have. Uh, yesterday, I won a game of Zoot. Won a game of Zoot. Yeah, okay. I did. Like, <laughs> I won. leadership at all? Oh, no. Like, GPA, teacher recommendations, any academic achievements? I mean, what are those though? Like ACT, honors, uh, AP, uh, beta. Is that like a club? I mean, you've definitely done something, right? I mean, probably. I'll just, I'll make a list. I'm sure there's something. Okay. Okay, actually, I have achieved nothing in four years. And I really need to put something on a college application. So vote for me. Thank you. Have a great day and go bikes. Ladies and gents of the class of 2018, I am Lexi Worley and I will be running for class officer. In my previous speeches, I have expressed my love for cereal. And I would just like to keep you updated and let you know that I still love cereal. But let's focus on something different this year. I would like to focus on Crocs. To be more specific, fuzzy Crocs. Not only are they easy to slip on and off, they also have fuzzy stuff on the inside that keeps your feet warm. They also come in different styles and colors that work for everyone. If you're thinking right now, I'll never wear Crocs, they're ugly. You're wrong, because when you're 80, you'll be wearing Crocs and you will look fantastic. I would also like to talk about my dog, Broccoli. Though he may not know how to sit, shake, or even lay down, he is still the best dog ever. I would like to leave you guys with a quote from the great Ricky Bobby. If you ain't first, you're last. Thank you. Hi, I am Ty Blevins, and I am running for senior class president. After a successful year as your previous president, I believe that I should run a, a second time so that I can once again channel my hard work into the betterment of our student body. I believe that I am the best person for this job, not only on the account of my looks, but also my Viking pride. I base my campaign around what the great president, Abraham Lincoln, said to me with his last words. A man with no Viking pride at all is not a man at all. Remember, vote tie and keep Tennessee High School great. Once upon a time, there was a barnacle, and he was so ugly that everyone died. And I am that barnacle. 
and I am ugly and I am proud. The first rule about presidential elections is that we don't talk about presidential elections. I understand that you don't want to listen to this all day, so I've kept it short. Well, if you don't already know, you might be wondering why I'm running for president. Well, four score and seven years ago, I had a dream. I had a dream when I was asleep. I'm pretty sure it had to do with that one time I was abducted by aliens, but anyways. I will say that 60% of the time, I'm right every single time. I do not support the No Child Left Behind Act. It hasn't helped me yet. Instead, I believe that we should enforce the No Child Running Ahead Act. I mean, what is wrong with you people? The only reason you would need to run is if you're being chased by a dinosaur or if you heard the ice cream truck. Oh, and gun control? Some people say that guns hurt people. And some people say that people hurt people. Want a piece of me? Yeah, I didn't think so. You know what? Your mom is stupid. Yeah, I said it. Loser. But I say that people hurt guns. Stupid guns! Oh my god! Ah! Oh, I saw it. You want the truth? Well, you can't handle the truth! Sorry. I'm still in therapy. My therapist says that life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Well, anyways, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to recite a poem I wrote for you all. Roses are red, violets are blue, I need to go to the bathroom. Ew. Toots for Prez! <laughs> 2K17! Hi, I'm Parker Mann. As you can probably tell, I'm running to be class president. But what you probably don't know is, I'm riding a tiny horse. But I'm not just riding this tiny horse for myself. I'm riding it for you, the class of 2018. Do my opponents ride tiny horses for you? I didn't think so. I would do anything for the senior class. As your class officer, I will fight for you. One thing I plan on doing as president is to continue the fight, to allow the senior lot to leave before the school buses. Another is to encourage personalization and to allow those in the senior lot to decorate their parking space, like we used to be able to do. And for those who still park in Southside, don't worry, we haven't forgotten about you, because I plan to fight to keep the other gates open to allow another exit out of the lot. Sound good? Don't just take my word for it. Here are some mostly positive remarks from our very own Tennessee High School teachers. On a scale of one to 10, Parker Mann is on that scale. Parker's smart, funny, and loved by everyone. Am I talking about Parker Mann or myself? I guess we'll never know. Hi, Miss Kirk. Oh, like hey. Hey, wait, how'd you get in my office? No, no, I don't Officer think... Camper, I need you to my office immediately. Okay, go, go. I think Parker Mann would be a great candidate for class president. Wait, who's Parker Man again? Oh, uh, that'd be me. Oh, okay. Uh, aren't, aren't you gonna say something? Nah. I think Parker Man will make a fantastic student council president. Wait, are you sure you're a teacher? Am I what? Puppies love him. Babies love him. Even grandmas love him. So wait, is that it? Yep. But like, where's the rest of it? I mean, we had a whole musical number and everything. They didn't approve of it. Oh, okay, um, but so wait, how am I supposed to end it now? What does the script say? Uh... 
says I'm supposed to tell them to vote for me. So just do that then. Okay, so uh, vote for Parker Man. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Vote Parker the Man for class officer. He's the man we need in office.